It's not financial advice, it's not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only and everything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial system based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, like YouTube algorithm and stuff. So you get the videos, I put them out, see so what I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. Um, last night, I was on the phone for like an hour and a half with uh, the, <laughs> the common sense investor, great guy, great mind. And uh, we were discussing, you know, our thoughts on the market, things like that. And I, I'm going to tell you something. Him and I both are on the same page that AMC, real market price, should be above $25 based on everything that's going on in the market. And we both believe that once AMC squeezes, once AMC squeezes and hit, hit those high, <laughs> hit those, those, those out, of, out of space numbers, we... I'm going to see it come back down to about $25, $30, and then it's going to keep running. Here's the thing. AMC is a great company fundamentally. When the market crashes, what goes up? Commodities, gold, silver. So high growth mining is going to keep doing well. We got the popcorn. That's going to sell because apes are going to buy the popcorn. If I go to the supermarket... And I see another brand. I'm going to call another brand, but I see another brand and I see AMC. What do you think I'm going to buy? I'm going to buy AMC. So that's four or five million people who are going to buy AMC popcorn. Plus, you still have a lot of people who go to the movies. They might not be AMC investors, but they love the AMC popcorn. So when they see it in the supermarket, they're going to purchase it also. And then we got the branded credit card and we might have collaboration with Disney and Amazon. So the fundamental of AMC is only going to get better and better and better. But here's the other thing. I believe there are about 30 to 40 billion counterfeit shares. And I'm going to tell you why. In the last two years, they have shorted the float of AMC over 80 times. Okay? So that's about 40 million right there. And every time they short, what has retail investors been doing? Retail investors have been buying the dips, buying the dips, buying the dips. And they just keep, well, now they use the tokenized, the tokenized shares to create these counterfeit shares. But the bottom line is this. They have shorted over 40 billion shares of AMC into the market. So as far as I'm concerned, there are between 30 and 40 billion counterfeit AMC shares. And they're going to have to buy back all of these shares, the real ones, and the counterfeits to close out their positions. And when they do, AMC is going to go to the moon. We're going to see a generational transfer of wealth. And then we'll just buy back into AMC and be giving those shares to our children and our grandchildren. Because I don't believe AMC is going anywhere. Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And please let me know what you think about the 35 billion counterfeit AMC shares. Have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.